एवरीवन हाउ आर यू वेलकम टू एनर्जी फोरकास्ट रीडिंग फॉर द साइन ऑफ टॉरस आई एम सो सॉरी फॉर द डिले लास्ट वीक समथिंग हैपन एंड वन साइन गॉट डिलेड एंड देन एवरीथिंग गॉट डिरेल एंड एवरीथिंग इज गेटिंग डिलेड नाउ होपफुली आई विल बी बैक ऑन ट्रैक वेरी सून बट लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड विद योर रीडिंग So I have ten cards for your Celtic cross. At the bottom of the deck is success, six of wands, and on the other side is wheel of fortune, fate. Wow, this is so beautiful. It says that you are destined for success. You are destined for victory. You are going to have a smooth ride towards whatever you have been wanting for a very long time. Right at the center is two of pentacles. which is almost saying that you possibly have lost hope between your past and present and you have lost hope for future and you're juggling between things to fulfill your ambitions but somewhere you have lost clarity also and you are struggling and the problem is that because of this you are not able to be compassionate towards people around you and that's also creating a very negative impact about you in your environment or you yourself are feeling very low that i'm not able to take care of a lot of people around me in the past you were acting very spontaneously because any idea or any plan that you were trying to implement or anything that you went in a structured way was not getting uh, fulfilled and you were like hopeless about it and you thought that i'll go with the flow and which was a very good strategy and right now you are struggling between structures and uh, going with the flow and you uh, because the new people that you have found in the present circumstances are more structured and you probably were going with the flow because nothing worked out for you in a structured way and now it's like should i be in a working in a structured more should i continue to work in a way where i just act and react to the things as they manifest uh in future what they are saying is that you will have to focus towards things where your passions are and that's where you need to plan things and that's where you need to concentrate your energy in next 7 days that's where you belong and that's where you have to shift your focus this will help you to find success in your social life and in more uh and earn more respect from the people around you because you are someone who has been focusing on their social aspects also but also focusing on your passions your place where your heart is what's below the surface is a deep energy where you are trying to understand everyone else's perspective but you are also realizing where your passion is and where your dreams are and you want to pursue them wholeheartedly the idea for you is to reflect on the past during the next 7 days and try to understand how and when you lost connection with your passion and now is the time for you to reconnect with your passion and also improve your ability to do something about it and invest time around that passion they are also telling if some of you will have to invest some money around it please go ahead and do that it might turn around that it, this investment around your passion will come back to you in multiple folds they are saying that it will come back exactly in 10 folds so that is a beautiful thing to know 
the fear is that any kind of kindness towards oneself your own self will actually create sorrow and you don't want to create that sorrow but that's a fear and you really don't have to go through that fear because that is not required right now and the other piece of advice is that you might have a lot of choices right now don't get confused between the choices because a complete way to success a complete recipe for success a complete understanding for success is only to follow your passion and there are some choices in front of you which do not allow you to pursue your passion whatever your passion is i'm not defining it because it would be very difficult in a general reading but then wherever your passion is go in that direction and then the final outcome is playfulness which says that you will have a lot of energy to enjoy life by the end of next 7 days because it's a court card i want to take more cards and then this card was also out it is like you have to change your foundation completely something where you are stuck between doing what others are expecting out of you or what is most practical in terms of your training uh, has to change and you need to emotionally withdraw from what your school training or your training from the society what whatever is expected out of you you need to emotionally withdraw from that follow your passion and be very playful towards it and be very happy after following that passion or at least start implementing something of that kind so that's your reading i hope this was useful please leave a comment below to help me understand if it related to it is somewhere resonating with you thank you so much until next time bye bye namaste